uh, personnel. Uh, the other aspects or the other key enabler of the command philosophy is also to ensure that um, uh, the personnel are highly motivated because that's the only way they can perform their jobs uh, you know, more efficiently. I uh, would realize that in any system of which the Air Force is not an exception, the most important element is the uh, human, it's a human being. Uh, and as such, we need to pay a lot of attention because uh, empirically it has been proven that um, a very highly motivated uh, individual, even with equipment that are not very sophisticated or so advanced, is able to achieve a lot. And, and the reverse is the case. Uh, an individual that is not highly motivated or is not adequately motivated, even with very high-tech equipment, very capable equipment, is not able to achieve much. So uh, giving credence to the fact that the human being is actually the most important element in any system. And that is why we are paying a lot of attention uh, in making sure that our personnel are highly motivated, providing you know, essential services, medicals, uh, accommodation, uh, again, training, some of the other intangible aspects, uh, very good leadership, because all those for, you know, contribute to make sure that uh, the soldier or the officer is highly motivated or otherwise. Uh, talking about the cap uh, capability of the Air Force, uh, at this time, which areas would